Welcome to AppBase.io. I'm Joy and today I'm going to tell you how to make your store search UX stand out using our no-code setup. This is especially valuable for Shopify stores as they are looking to create a more customized search experience. With UI integrations from AppBase.io, business teams will be able to visually edit the look and feel of their stores at any time using the live preview. You can check out the look on the desktop as well as on mobile resolutions in a simple click and have a look at how the filters function on your site as well. Let's get started. Um, first thing you see when you enter the UI integrations tab is selecting the platform. We are going to stick with Shopify for now. Next, in the store info, you can select the default currency for your store. Heading to the layout and design tab, first thing we select here is the search layout. Now, Classic has clearly defined boxes for filters and facets, making it a great fit for multi-category stores and minimal, which has a streamlined view and is preferred by fashion and jewelry retailers. Next, heading on to the style presets tab, here you can set the colors for filters, product names, and descriptions that appear on the search results page. You can also select the preferred font family here. Next, heading on to the custom CSS page, you can copy and paste desired properties and edit them. For example, let me let me show you how our store looks currently. So here you can see that the products are not separated by cards. If I simply copy and paste this, however, and then check out the store preview again, the changes are reflected in real time. Once you are done with this, let's head to search settings. If you click on the uh, configure search settings button, you will be taken to our search relevancy tab. And here you can add weights, enable typo tolerances, synonyms, set query rules, and do much more. And once you are satisfied with how your search relevancy is set up, we can head back to UI integrations. Next, looking at the filters tab, you can personalize which filters you want to appear on your store. For example, if I show my filters tab again, I currently have three filters showing. And with this, I now have four product type, collections, color, and price. You can also add customized filters very easily by simply clicking on this button, adding the desired field you want, and giving it a name and clicking save. After that, looking at the results tab, businesses will be able to exercise even more control over their search results. This includes having popular suggestions enabled, infinite scroll or pagination options, data that appears along with the search results, etc. Finally, in the custom messages, you can edit the text that appears at various points of the search journey. Once you're all set with everything, you can now hit the export code button. You can check the API credentials that you have entered by going over to this link and copy pasting your API credentials in this page. I recommend that you have this toggled on so that whenever people click on the search button, they get taken to the search results page directly. Once you're all set, hit continue and you will be shown a snippet now there are handy installation instructions that are available here and since i've already added this to our store uh, let's just have a live example of the search now on our search results page let me make a quick search and this shows how the search works on our live website as well. Thanks for watching.